Greetings and welcome back to Idle Miner Tycoon. All right, we are in the Titanite mine. We did a prestige of this in the uh, previous episode. I have advanced it down to here. Uh, this is now the big money maker. Let's just check it out for a second here. All the way down to the Dawn continent. You can see that the Titanite mine is now doing 38.7 AL, whereas the Heliodor mine, the now second place uh, money maker, is doing 12.9. And of course, when this uh, barrier goes down, we'll be able to go down a little bit further. So hopefully this will make us a lot of money so we can advance the rest of the continent. But that is not why we're here today. Oh, and by the way, you'll notice we now have enough money to open up the turquoise mine. We'll probably do that in a couple of days. But like I was about to say, that is not the reason we are here today. We're here because today is St. Patty's Day. And uh, opening today is the St. Patty's Day mine. So let's go in and see what the wee people have for us. All right, I'm going to blow through this fairly quickly. Uh, participation badge for just starting it up, right? Mineshaft 5 gets us some super cash and season points. Season points are, of course, for the month-long event in which to earn rewards. So that's all I'm going to say about that. All right, we can get a 10 times for 5 minutes here, some more season points, uh, a bronze badge at Mineshaft 15, and a 10 times for 10 minutes at Basically, mine shaft number 20, we get the uh, 20 for 10 minutes and we get some more super cash. We get a dawn research point over here at 25 and uh, some more super cash. At uh, mine shaft 30, we get a two times for four hours, a dawn research point, some more super cash, and of course, season points. All right, getting mine shaft number 16 to 500 will get us a silver St. Patrick's Day 2020 badge as well as a two times for eight hours, another Dawn research point, and 60 super cash. Uh, getting mineshaft number 20 to 600 is a two times for 12 hours, a Dawn research point, a rare chest, 80 super cash, and some more season points. And this one looks like it's going to be a 500. Yes, it is, a 530. It looks like that's how much super cash we're going to get for this one. Because if you get mineshaft number 25 to 700, you'll get a five times for an hour, another Dawn research point. Two uh, rare chests and 100 super cash. That was a dead giveaway. Because if you bring everything to max level, all of the mine shafts to 800, the elevator and the warehouse to 2400, you will get the gold St. Patrick's Day 2020 badge. You'll get five green research points. I think that's going to be the six dawn research point for a total of six, an epic chest, and 200 super cash, as well as some more season points. And of course, if you do that in a day and a half, you'll get the elite badge, as well as an extra 80 season points. All right, so I shouldn't have closed that. What I should have done is press this button. Okay, so he's got some uh, shamrocks there, and he's got some hats. I guess he stole those from some leprechauns. You're not supposed to let the leprechaun get away, by the way. He will trick you. He will say, hey, look over there. The moment you take your eye off the leprechaun, he will vanish. As long as you're watching him, he can't get away. And you can get him to give you your pot of gold. Remember that. That's if you ever happen to find one. Good luck with that, by the way. Anyway, uh, speaking of riches, I think before we do anything here... We should boost, which is exactly what I did. I watched a video for a video boost. I use one of my two times for an hour. So this should move a lot quicker. So let's get going. Uh, you get to work over here because first of all, we have to get all this activated here, right? All right, we need mineshaft number one there to get to level five in order to get managers to automate the process. But I figure let's just go right for 10 because that's what I like to do, especially if we have a nice multiplier. By the way, you go down there, you bring that up. As soon as that reaches the top, the uh, warehouse dude with the mine cart will activate. And he'll carry that back. All right, you get to work. You got to keep clicking on these guys for now. And we should easily have enough money to do that. All right, I'm just going to say 10 here and get 11. All right, so we got lots of stuff open right now, but I want some automation because I don't like clicking on these slackers. All right, and you too. All right, and of course, we now have access to mineshaft number two, but we're going to need 1,360, and I have a feeling we're about to get that. There, boom. All right, and let's just hire somebody and then immediately take them out because I like having those um, 
discount individuals handy. By the way, why don't you make that guy run and make them uh, mine really fast? All right, so now we need 13,600, and uh, we're not going to get that while he's only carrying that a little amount. So what I'm going to do is go for here and just say, give it to all. He should be able to just easy up, grab that, no problem at all. All right, and by the way, run really fast. By the way, I'm pretty sure, yep, there we go. All right, and let's hire another manager. And she can make this guy run really fast. All right, so we have a pile forming on top of the um, top of the elevator. I'm, I need to do this too. I want them buffed as possible. That's the highest priority for me right now. That way we don't have to worry about the flow of money, right? All right, that one is near 50. And this one, of course, is also near 50. See, I'm about to lose the discount in the elevator. I'd like to take advantage of it while I have it. All right, and then you here. Okay, we got a 50 over there, which is a nice boost. And the last one here. Okay, we should be good to go for now. All right, so let's focus on this since this is now available. All right, and then, of course, I'm going to hire somebody and immediately remove them because that executive is very important. All right, and by the way, make them work really hard. All right, I need 1.36 million. So I have a million already. I don't think we're going to have to wait too long for that. And there you go. We got like 5 million now. So boom. All right, so we got that one open. So let's hire a manager. She's going to make him work really hard. All right, we need 21.4 million. Now let's see. Is everything flowing good at the moment? Oh, yes. The mine shafts are producing about a million per second, but they can both handle, you know, almost three and a 13 and a quarter. So we're good to... Oh, and there we go. Boom. And I am going to spend 57 super cash. It is painful, but I'm going to do it. And then I'm going to open this. All right, so let's continue. I need 136 million, all right, uh, which we now have. It's really good to get the elevator and the warehouse going. Although I think we're probably going to have problems now. Oh, 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 no, 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 put that there. And run really fast. Do we have a problem now? Oh, yeah. Yep, yep, we definitely have problems now. All right, so there are too much money being produced down here. And, of course, we need 1.36 billion in order to open up the next one. And he just left that behind, didn't he? Yep, yep. So we're going to have to do something about that. All right, we're going to go searching over here for another discount. Okay, it's just a junior, but it will have to do. At the moment, I, I like the running thing, so I'm going to leave that for now. All right, what can I do here? Here, take that. It's a lot, but I don't care. And you take that. All right, take some of that. Okay, so there's a lot up here. There's a lot of space up here right now. now. So we shouldn't have any trouble... Yep, he just carried three and a half billion up. So I have a feeling that is. Yep, there we go. All right, so let's. Oh, we got the next one too. Boom, multiplication. All right, higher and then immediately take that one out. I like to have those available to me. I don't want to go looking for them, right? And then we'll hire somebody for here. And by the way, run really fast, run really fast. Okay, so 24 billion. I don't think that the elevator is going to handle billions of that magnitude. Pretty darn sure that's not going to happen. Actually, I was wrong. Okay, I guess we boosted it up pretty darn well there. I'm about to lose this one, so I'm just going to say 20. Um, yeah, I'll leave that one there for now. And I'm just going to say max here. Because I don't want to have to worry about the situation for a while. Unfortunately, I'm losing the running buff over here, which is a little annoying. But oh, 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 we got uh, mine shaft number nine is now available. The money is flowing. All right. And of course, uh, make him mine really fast. I need 1.36 trillion now, but I already have over 800 billion. So I don't think that that's going to be a problem. Even though, yeah, he did leave some behind, didn't he? Okay, I uh, very nearly have it, actually. 
Okay, so we're going to have to do some work here because uh, he can't carry all of that. But I'm pretty darn sure... Yep, yeah, we probably have it now, right? Yep, there we do. All right, so that is going to be mine shaft 10. And I'm going to actually put the executive there. Okay, currently the mine is doing 23 billion per second, but the problem is that it's not being handled properly, right? Mine shafts are producing 345 billion, but the, uh, they can only handle about 40, so we're going to have to do some boosting up here, right? All right, I lost the uh, discount over here, but getting one here will be easy. Do I have the other one back yet? In 12 seconds, I will. All right, so I'll do this one first. All right, so we need to do some boosting. I'm thinking one, two, three for the moment. And as soon as this is done, all right. All right, one, two, three, four. And then another one over here. Try to keep them fairly even. They're handling trillions. Uh, one more on the uh, warehouse side. Like I said, I kind of like them to be close to even. I think that's better. Okay, so the mine is being handled now, and I see that we have our barrier open. It's uh, currently doing 173 billion per second. So obviously that is not going to do. What I like to do with the event mines at this stage is try to get the first 10 to generate as much money as possible, which is the reason the executive is down here. So we're just going to start turning this up. So doing a lot of boosting in terms of the one that's going to make me the most money, which is the lowest one, and then you have to go and basically raise the... Um, these individuals over here. All right, hold on a second. Just basic, I'm about to lose that one because I can get another one over here fairly easily. Right there. All right, so that one is 200 for now. All right, I'm just going to do this and take all of that. Okay, a little bit. Okay, just do that. Right, just do that. All right, so they're handling lots of trillions, although the elevator is a little bit of an issue. Not much I can do about that, so I'm just going to have to spend without a discount. I don't want to pull the Goodmans out just yet. All right, so how are we doing? I think that'll do. I'll get a little boost over here since the elevator is so big. Okay, that's good. So we can go right back down here and start making some more money. Currently, the mine is doing 8.51 trillion per second, but the... Um, Elevator in the warehouse can handle a lot more, so why don't we just, boom, 41. If I can get that up a couple more, okay, 164 trillion. Now, are they still handling that? Yes, they are. All right, so the first uh, issue is going to be the elevator, but I don't think it's an issue just yet. All right, so we're going to let more money show up, and we're going to boost the um, this one right here, mineshaft number 10. I'd like to see two arrows. One arrow isn't really worth pressing the button. There we go. Okay, 384 trillion per second. Problem? Yes, we do have a problem. We have a problem in the elevator. All right, so let's see. This one, I'll get this one back in 12 seconds, although we are starting getting closer to the time. You know what? I think the Goodman's time has come. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to go right for the Goodmans. Of course, the Goodmans are my super managers for the elevator and the warehouse. Now, I am I have them, and I'm using them because, one, I'm doing a video, right? It's going to speed things up. You don't need them at this stage, but like I said, I just want to speed things up. You can just basically wait for your, uh, your managers to come back, or you can just go looking for more. You know, you can just go searching until you can get some more of them, you know? Uh, put them there. And by that, you can just say, you know, higher, higher. You can just keep looking until you get one. Like, for instance, there's the, uh, the senior right there. Of course, I'm going to be using the senior later, you know, but this one here, this one is really easy to get to the executive, but I'm going to go with the Goodmans for now. And by the way, while I'm talking, I'm letting the money build up here a little bit. All right, so let's activate them because they have the best uh, discount that I have, but the thing about them is they only last for uh, five minutes. So you have to take advantage of them while you have them, right? Okay, we're doing uh, 498 trillion now. So let's go on back down here and crank that up. Okay, we're doing nearly 6 AA. 
All right, and we got some more here. Get up to 90, 7.13. How are we doing? Okay, a little bit of... Okay, I better work... Actually, they're doing fine. 84 and 131. We're only doing 12 and a half. So we can pop back down here. I'd like to get that over 100. I need a second arrow for that. How are we doing over here? Okay, they're bringing a load over. We'll probably get that second arrow. There we go. Okay, 48.2 AA per second being handled um not in the elevator all right so let's go on back up all right so how much is this 41 2 that's going to be a boost so i don't have to worry about that one anymore here take that that's looking good it's looking good uh, a little bit more over here and let's head back down and some more have another 13 326 AA. I'd like to get at very least deep into AB. That way I know a lot of money is being made. And when this is ready here, I can just grab the next five and then get the next barrier going away. That's how I, uh, how much money I intend to have. Here, have some more. Okay, 542 AA. Is there an issue? Not at the moment. We are closing in on an issue though. We are, because they're doing A, B, but, you know, just over the line there. So let's see. Four more. Okay, 902. Okay, we're closing in on the warehouse. How much time do I have for them? Okay, about two minutes and 45 seconds each, so that's good. The more money we're creating, the better. All right, we're doing an A, B here, and I'm willing to bet we just walked all over both of them. All right, let's go back up. So the money is going to pile up down below because they can't take it up. So we have to give them a little bit of leeway. So I can do 50 of both of these. 50. And back over here. Oh, oh not quite yet. 47. I'd like... Okay, there we go. We got 50. Okay, so that's 2.2 AB per second at the top. But we were just encroaching on them by a little bit. So we're going to go back down and increase that even more. So when I get all the way down to Mineshaft 30, I'm going to be doing that in Mineshaft 30, right? Because that's the best money maker. The farther you can go down, okay, nearly 15 AB, the farther you can go down, the more money you're going to make. And then all you have to do is make it so the elevator and the warehouse can actually carry it all up, and then you actually get the money, because the money is not real money until it goes into the warehouse. So you have to get it up there, right? Then, okay, have a little bit more here. Oh, 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 I got some at the last minute here. Okay, 38.8. I might have run into a problem now. Oh, we're getting close to the uh, warehouse. We are. So the better this is, since it's all being processed, the more money I'm going to have to be able to raise the guys up above. And then when you're doing that, eventually you're going to have so much extra money that you will just be able to max out these other mines. You know, it's just you'll be making so much money down below and the money will be making the whole course through the system that you'll just be able to go max, 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 max like that. So that's the way I do these. All right, let's, I'm just going to 50 over here. What have I got? 30. I'm just going to hit you with that um, now that I have it back. Let's see, what do we got? Okay, they're doing AC now. All right, so the money is coming in pretty good. How... The warehouse is not as good. I like them being even. That's pretty darn even right there. That's pretty darn, right. I think the difference in the levels has to do with the cards that I have. You know, the the little ones that uh, you use for upgrading, you get in the chests, you know, the special individuals. I think that might be the reason for the difference. All right, let's see, 11 over here. Okay, we're doing 129 EB per second. Easily handling it, because they considering they're doing a C, right? All right, have some more. Money being dropped over there. Okay, so unfortunately I've lost them, but I already got managers. The executive here is too expensive to use now. I think it's 85 AD 
that you would need to actually get him. So if I do need to move any more increases over here, I'm going to be using the uh, senior here. Now here, the executive is easy to get, so not a problem. The problem is that this guy here lasts for more than 14 minutes. Well, nearly 14 minutes, right? And this one here lasts for just over four minutes. So you have to pick your times, right? All right, what do you got? Okay, we're closing in. 769 AB. Okay, I got another one. Okay, 875. No problem yet. No problem yet. I would like to get over that mark. Oh, very close. Very close. Very close. It's psychological. I would like to get there, right? And I don't think we're having any problems here. And that should do it. Okay, so now we're doing 1.45 AC per second. Now, is this a problem? Nope, it's all being handled. So the mine shafts are doing 2.54 AC, and the elevator can handle 3.57 AC, and the warehouse can handle 3.81 AC, which means everything is gonna be gathered up, everything is gonna be processed. So I am just gonna let it go there, let it build up money, and then, like I said, when this barrier's time comes, I'm going to be able to buy the next five mine shafts and get the next barrier going immediately. Anyway, this is the uh, St. Paddy's Day mine, 2020. And uh, it is going to be running for another five days, seven hours, and 25 minutes at the time of recording. The rewards are pretty good. Dawn research points, green research points, 530 super cash, a lot of good boosts in there. So, you know... If uh, there's any of these mines that are worth doing, this one is definitely worth doing. Anyway, I think that is going to be it for now. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.